It reminds me of the, the apostles themselves. When, they, when, when Jesus looked at them, everybody else had left them. And he said, are you two going to leave me? And they said, where else are we going to go? You have the words of life. And that's what I would say to people who are wrestling with the Bible and they have questions. Maybe they've, they've never realized they should be asking before and they're feeling a bit unnerved by some of this stuff or wondering about the kinds of questions that progressives might be raising for them is ask yourself, where else are you going to find the words of life? Because at the end of the day, that pastor has to say to his congregation, I'm the source of the words of life. And my moral intuitions and the moral intuitions fed to me by my surrounding culture, that's what allows me to then stand in judgment over the Apostle Paul. And I want to say, friends, the Christian church has stood for centuries, for millennia, by standing on the authority of the Apostle Paul and the other apostles and the Old Testament and being able then to confront the culture around them with that. Think very carefully about what you are giving up and what you are getting.